we are heading up to get a closer look at some sheep we've watched the last couple days we've watched them at a distance and you can tell one ram's fairly long so we're gonna go up and get closer see what we can find out about him see how old he is Same thing every day, they're bouncing back and forth across, across the stop. We didn't see them on our side this morning, so probably gonna happen is we'll get over here to glass and they'll have gone over. So, but uh, man, man, turn good women home, make bastards out of their sons and fools of themselves. They're only judged by God and the fruits that they've dropped and left there to rot. All the weeds that they grew are never ending. They slave the whole human race, making dollars off our fate while your hands getting stained. Transaction time is all we got left. So count your cards and hold your breath. What a fool state of mind. But hey, it's a paycheck, it's a paycheck. God only Came up this big basin to look for some rams and couldn't find them, so now we're moving even higher. It's pretty awesome up here, actually. You can see the tops of all the mountains. Just crossing my fingers that there's some sheep up here. A lot of snow left, so it makes it hard to see them. But super neat country.
Camp. Back to camp. Yeah, over eight miles or so. What eight point four five. What elevation? And a mystery ram. We've watched him for. Look back on my notes. Saw him on day six. Today's day ten. Saw him yesterday. Didn't see him today. When we covered that mountain. I felt better than we've done a lot of country. So. I don't know where he went. Saw one grizzly, a couple rams across the river, but we didn't see out of the six sheep we were trying to find today, three ewes and three rams, we didn't see any of them. Cut the ewes tracks going north, never cut the ram tracks. So, long day, long day in the boots, ready to get them off and relax. What's that? Oh, I'm just taking a video here. Showing all my shit that's got to go inside of that backpack. Going to move down the river and across to the other side. Everybody's just finishing up getting their packs loaded up probably be crossing the river here shortly so got our river shoes and a whole bunch of food there she is yep exactly. all 80 pounds of her mm -hmm. <laughs> here <we go>. cheers <laughs> Well, back in our normal clothes, out of the river, getting a snack, throw our packs on, and then we're gonna head up there. Nice looking ram up there. He's uh, I don't know, this is where a good guide comes in. Worth their weight in gold. Cause uh, I look at this ram and I can tell
tell he's a little longer on his left. A little broomed on his right. He's looks like he's got decent mass, but at the same time, his body size doesn't look quite as hefty as these other rams we've been looking at. I do know he's definitely worth getting a closer look, and there's a ridge between us and him. Time. <laughs> I think his curl might be a little tighter. ram that we Kevin spotted down on camp. It's a, it's a good tight curl, heavy ram, heavy ram. But uh, we keep moving up the mountain pretty soon. We'll be even with him, get a good view, make a decision from up there if we're gonna take him or not. It's day 10, so that kind of plays in on it too. Weather can roll in anytime and we'll lose days of hunting, but he looks like a heavy ram. We'll get up close and get an age on him. Same spot. He's, he's down. Just wait. He's down. Oh. Just leave him. Leave him. Don't, don't move. Don't, don't shoot. Don't move. Don't move. Stay. I think we just won the lottery. We just won the lottery. <laughs> Shit. That was a fucking nice shot, man. <coughs> you just ripped it nail or him. stood up and tipped over backwards. I don't know how he stood up. Oh, man. I need to 
still in the frame on this one. Yeah, I never touched it. Decided to do the last kick and roll. <laughs> Dude, he was like, oh. and it's like, oh, he's a goner. I thought he was gonna go down that thing for sure. Well, let's um, let's get up there a little way up. Those freaking pictures are gonna be tits. <laughs> oh, man, thanks guys. No, thank you. Yeah, I'm in voice. We're caribou hunting now. That's right. <laughs> That was a that was a big deciding factor right there. And look where camp is. Mm. See the tent? God, I can't believe he just backflipped. In a... <laughs> Thank God he didn't broom that one side because that's what <laughs> saved him. <laughs> you have a double broomer. <laughs> I'm shaking a little bit, but I just shot a doll sheep in the prettiest place on the planet. I mean, look at this. Arctic Red River right there. Just snow-capped mountains everywhere. And a sheep is laying right there. Pretty awesome feeling just to be up here backpacking for 10 days so far. And uh, our camp is way down there. And uh, yeah, we're gonna go take care of this guy and hopefully go do some caribou hunting. Kevin's been itching to do some caribou hunting, so. Check with you at the ram over here. This, uh, this right here has been a dream come true. Book this hunt several years ago with Mr. Cody Warmans and uh, Cody came last year and killed a beautiful ram. So Kevin filled in, took his spot and uh, I've been planning, saving, looking forward to this for a long time. So I want to thank Andrew, our, our guide. He's been awesome. I want to thank Kevin for all the help and Tavis for having us here at Arctic Red River. And uh, I think I'll come back one of these years. That's all I got. Hey there friends, uh, I just wanted to say a few things to wrap up this video. First and foremost, thank you so much for watching the video and thank you for the positive feedback. There's a lot of familiar names and faces on here and it's good to see you guys back. Thank you for the positive feedback, it means a lot to us. Um, number two, we're still doing a big giveaway this year. All of our favorite companies pitched in again. They're giving away a bunch of gear and it's on our website. There's a page on our website, it's a giveaway page. All you gotta do is put your name and your email address in there and enter to win. And if you entered last year or 
if you're on our mailing list, that doesn't automatically put you in there. So you have to go to the website and you have to do that. Um, sorry, we'll put a description down or a link in the description, make it a little easier to get to. Uh, a couple simple steps and you are entered to win all that cool stuff. So welcome back to season five. Thanks for being here. Uh, and uh, tomorrow or the next couple episodes, we're going to be hunting caribou in the Northwest Territories. And you don't want to miss it. It's pretty cool. And then we've got a bunch of other stuff coming as well. So um, thanks again for watching. If you like the videos, please do us a favor. Please hit that subscribe button. That helps us out a lot. And uh, if you don't mind, share it with a friend. Hit that share button. So um, thanks for everything, guys. And we're excited to be back and excited you're back. We'll see you on tomorrow's episode. Thanks.